Question 13. Here are a pencil sharpener, a key and a rubber. So this is actual size with a ruler. It says, what is the length of all three things together? Give your answer in millimetres. Well, as you can see, all three things together, just double check that it starts level with zero, which it does, so that's fine. All three things together go to 8.1.2.3. So this measurement here is 8.3 centimetres. But it does say give our answer in millimetres. So if we put 8.3 in there, that is going to be incorrect because that's the answer in centimetres and it wants to know the answer in millimetres. So the question we need to think about is how many millimetres is this? Well, remember, every one centimetre is worth 10 millimetres. So 8 centimetres would be 80 millimetres millimeters so 8.1 centimeters would be 81 millimeters 8.2 centimeters 82 millimeters so 8.3 centimeters is 83 millimeters and that's the answer to part one the next part of the question says what is the length of the key also we've got to give this in millimeters so we're interested in just the key now what we can't do is take this measurement here, which is 5.3 centimetres, which is 53 millimetres. We can't just say that that's the length of the key, because the key doesn't start at zero. The key starts here. The key starts on this line, which is 2.4 centimetres or 24 millimetres. So the gap from 24 millimetres up to 53 millimetres, that is the length of the key. So we need to find that gap. And to find the gap between those two numbers, we just find the difference between them. So we're looking for the difference between 53 millimetres and 24 millimetres. Anytime you find the difference, the easiest way to do it is to do a subtraction column method and we'll get the answer so three take away four we can't do so we borrow one and that now becomes 13 13 take away four is nine and four take away two is two so the answer is 29 millimeters